Hey everyone, it is Gadget Guru HD here, and in this video, I'll be unboxing and giving a first look of the new Google Nexus 5. Now, the Nexus 5 is Google's latest flagship smartphone running the newest version of Android, 4.4 KitKat. And like previous Nexus phones, the 5 is extremely cheap, costing only $350 for the base 16GB model and $400 for the 32GB model. Now, you do want to keep in mind that these prices are exclusive to the Google Play Store so that the prices are actually going to be much higher when you go into a local carrier such as T-Mobile or Sprint. The approach that Google has been taking with these newer Nexus phones is very different as the Nexus 5 is actually sold unlocked and completely free of any bloatware or carrier branding. So essentially you can take this device to T-Mobile, AT&T or Sprint and it should work fine with their networks. As for what's actually inside of the box, everything is pretty much standard. You'll get a quick start guide, a manual, pretty much how to use the Nexus 5, and you also get your power charging brick and micro USB cable so you all can charge up the device. Taking a look at the actual Nexus 5 itself, we're just gonna go ahead and peel off this sticker here and we're going to boot up the device. Now while I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and take you guys a tour around the phone. That way you can see where everything is actually located. Now starting from the bottom, you can see that we have the dual stereo speakers and also our micro USB ports. And you can also see here on the boot animation, this is actually the new Android 4.4 KitKat one. It may be familiar to you all if you've ever used any of the Google Play Edition devices. And moving toward the left, we'll find the volume rockers. Up the top, we'll have the headphone jack. And moving towards the right, we'll find the power button and also the SIM eject tray. Towards the back, we will find our rear-facing camera and LED flash, and also the Nexus branding, which is actually horizontal, like the one on the Nexus 7 2013 edition. So I've been using the Nexus 5 for about several hours or so, and just in those three hours, it's definitely been pretty snappy. Haven't noticed any or too much lag, but of course, I'll be keeping you all updated for my full review. And in the meantime, I'll be giving you all more updates in gaming tests, that way you can see how it stacks up to the rest of the competition in terms of gaming. I'll have a comparison between the Galaxy Note 3, so if there's anything you guys would like to see on the channel, please do let me know and I'll try and get that done for you all. If you enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe for more awesome Nexus 5 content. Thanks for watching everyone and I'll see you all in the next video.